We all love a bit of reality TV, don't we? Keeping up with the Kardashians, you know, jungle. But, 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 would you watch Keeping Up with the Reese Moggs? Not kidding. It's been reported that Jacob Reese Moggs has been approached by Disney Plus to, well, film a fly on the wall series. Discovery Plus, Disney Plus, Discovery Plus, I think it is, uh, featuring him and his family. Uh, Rhys Mogg says he's very flattered and that he is actually thinking about it. <laughs> so it's, it's like it's like Moggle Box, isn't it? See, see what I did there? It's clever, isn't it? Uh, Any case, um, Scarlett and Emma are still here and they've stopped talking about politicians' nether regions. Yeah, funny. So we're going to now talk about would you watch Jacob Rhys Mogg? You know, it's sort of like a Kardashians thing, but with the Mogs. How many kids has he got? Six. Six, six kids. Because the sixth one is called Sixtus or something. In fact, wasn't there, maybe there was a child called Septus? Maybe it's seven. Anyway, they're all his. Sectus. They're all his. Sectus? They're all his and his wife's. Um, I, actually, I would watch it, but I think it would be ter a terrible decision by Jacob Rees-Mogg because... Because either it's going to be completely fixed and nothing's going to come through, or else it's just going to completely wreck his, you know, his whole standing. I mean, for God's sake, it, keeping up with the Kardashians. I mean, does he really want to join that? Is he really interested in fame so much? I mean, it... it... Well, you know, what? I mean, to be fair to, to Jacob, he is very eccentric. I would... I mean, I... doesn't he still have a nanny? I would absolutely. I think this would be absolutely fascinating. He lives in a stately home. He's actually, uh, you know, he's made a hundred million pound fortune. He's a very, very clever investment banker. Yeah. He's got six children, as you say. He's married to this heiress. He's hilariously kind of formal. He goes out campaigning, and you see his little kind of mini me, the son, one of the sons, oh, God, yeah. who kind of dresses like a little grown up, but you know those little Dickensian kind of outfits. Little, little Fontroy. Goes out, yeah, goes uh -huh. out campaigning with nanny. And I think Nanny was his nanny when he yeah, was a little that's, boy. that's weird. I think it would be fascinating. I don't think Jacob will do it. I think he's so polite that he probably said, mm, that's an interesting idea, and isn't ruling it out. But it would be really interesting. I, I think he's got a wicked sense of humour under there. I don't think he takes himself too seriously, you know. No, I think as I said, I, I, I would watch it, and oh. I'm sure and I'm sure lots and lots of other, and I think it's a very good idea by Discovery TV, but... but but, I mean... I think it would break all the election rules, by the way, about broadcasting and what you can and can't say. Oh, I'm well, not sure well, he could well, actually we're do We're talking it. about once he loses his seat, seat, which is highly likely. To the Lib Dems? Apparently it's yeah. Labour. I assumed it was the Lib Dems when I did tell him on air that he was going to lose it because Suella was so ghastly yeah. and all the nice people would vote Lib Dem. But apparently it's Labour. Uh, and, it, I mean, it's certainly well within the realms of possibility, yeah. depending on you know, what, yeah. what goes down. It was actually reported in, our, in the GB News exclusive mm. poll that, you know, he is one of the, the big beasts of the Conservative Party that yeah. he's in, in, in danger of... Um, <laughs> danger he's of also danger. really popular, though. He's a little bit like Nigel Farage. You think, oh, you know, mm -hmm. posh boy Jacob rees -Mogg. He's really popular with, with everyday people who say, do you know what, that man talks sense. Well, that man is honest and he talks straight and he I'm, says I'm what he gonna, thinks. Because he says what he thinks. That's yes. the thing Charles about him. Go. Yes. Boris Johnson on Love Island next. Boris Johnson would be hilarious. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, on that note, they we'll leave it for now. They wouldn't pay him enough. Saucy you.